And then when you have the hospitals, you know, our Centers for Medicaid, uh, CMS, giving hospitals a 20% bonus payout on the entire hospital admission, if they use the experimental remdesivir, then you could understand, too, why hospitals were saying, no, you're not going to give ivermectin. You're not going to dispense it. They told the pharmacist that, you know, even in our big uh, chains, Walgreens, CVS. No, you're not giving it. There was a financial incentive to do that. And, you know, and then you have the nurses and doctors, you know, that were going along with this. Now, I would still... uh, be safe to say that probably 99% do not know that there was a financial incentive behind giving remdesivir to the hospitalized patients, you know, but what they did have a moral and ethical obligation to do would be to look at the medication and say, is my, is this patient contraindicated in it? If not, no harm, no foul, let them try it. Let doctors practice medicine. But they didn't do that either. 